With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello guys, we have sine cos inverse 3 by 5 is equal to. So in this question, we have to do something that this cos inverse convert into sine. So let's take this cos inverse 3 by 5 is equal to x. So this become 3 by 5 is equal to cos x and we know that cos x is equal to base upon hypotenuse. If we draw a triangle, let's draw a triangle. Let's say this is angle x. So from here we can say that base is 3, hypotenuse is 5. So to find the perpendicular, we use Pythagoras theorem that is 25 minus 9 root is equal to p. So p, p is equal to 4. So its value is 4. So from here we can say that sin x is equal to 4 by 5. Now if we put this value sin x in here we get x is equal to sin inverse 4 by 5. So, equivocal question become sin into sin inverse 4 by 5. So, here sin and sin inverse cancel out each other. So, we will remain with 4 by 5. Now, if we check our options, so from here we can see that our option number 4 is correct. So, guys, this is the answer. I hope you guys like it. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.